So like this is the really worrying thing about the trophy case again is people are saying if they drip feed them if they drip fed them and gave us two every single week or one every single week i'd be fine with that i don't think anyone would really be um that annoyed with that but the issue is that every one of these cards are available day one which means that i don't know how they're going to do it like i think maybe again that they put it in option packs so that you can pick and choose what teams you do so that each team each week you're allowed to do one team but again, all that's going to do is it means that every, um, unless these cards gradually update throughout the year, which you're not going to do, um, you're going to be seeing cards that are either way, are going to be way too overpowered in day one. And then by halfway through season two, you're going to be looking at bums. There's not going to be that like middle point. It's not going to be that middle point. It's going to be they're way too overpowered than they're bums. It's going to be like a straight, like, they're going to be, sorry, there's going to be, just going to gradually become bums. They're going to become bums in the first 10 weeks of the game. Like, nobody was using Wall Frazier in season two. And that's what the issue is, like, it takes the first freaking Penny Hardaway to be released to make all these cards, like, basically useless. Like, like, if you want the specific cards, great. Like, if you want a specific Derrick Rose, great. But if you think that this Derrick Rose is going to be the damn start, best starting point guard in the game past middle of October, you're you're going to be mistaken. You are going to be mistaken. If we are complete, being completely honest with this. But um, I think they'll start off the game really well. I think a lot of people are saying they don't care if it's fun cards. I think it's going to be really... My only my only big issue with the trophy case, or I think it's going to be NBA 75th all over again. That it's going to be a really cool concept on week one. But 2K are going to expect that we're going to stay equally as hyped for it in February as we are in week one. And we're just not going to be. That's kind of what I think is going to happen. But um, for people saying it's it's grindable content, that's all I wanted. No, it's not. I want specific, specific grindable content that is updated frequently. I hate it when 2K put in one giant grind and then nothing for three weeks. I hated every bit of that. People saying I just want grindable content. That is objectively wrong. That is objectively wrong. I have been very specific in what I want. Season 6 is what I want. Specific, frequently updated, grindable content. That is achievable. The issue is, is that it's highly likely that these cards are all going to be demons at the start of the year. And then by Season 3, we're all going to forget about it and be like, Oh, remember how... Why are we ever hyped up for this? Remember how much Tuka hyped this up? 